Well, howdy folks. Charlie with Typewriter Justice here, and... You know... Sometimes... I just get... Entirely too smitten. <laughs> with this model. I really do. And I can't resist. This one was offered up locally. A buddy of mine sent me the link to the Facebook Marketplace ad for it. And damn it, I couldn't resist. Because it's got like one ding right there. A little bit of flaking on the outside edge of the lid or uh, the base plate. One scratch right there. Well, two, I guess, but they're in the same location. And uh, that's, <laughs> that's about it. In short, stinking gorgeous. Look at how smooth and dent free for the most part. Very rarely have I seen one that nice. And uh, what made it even harder to resist is that. Sitting there on his front porch, I saw that. And I asked him again, how much? And he said, rah, 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 rah. and I said, okay, sold. Because that means uh, it's not a regular typeface. That, in this case, meant it's cursive script, right? So we had a 1963 Hermes 3000 in script. It's been fully refurbished fresh rubber on the platen fresh rubber on the paper bale rollers for that matter I redid those original feed rollers but they've been nicely cleaned still very supple all new motion limiter bumper doodad pieces of rubber inside have been changed New feet. Compliments of Steve Dade. Platinum rubbers compliments JJ Short. Gave her a chemical clean. Full tuning. Did a little uh, sound dampening. Did a little... rattle reduction because there are some inherent rattles on this model and you can get rid of them if you know where to look and what to do oh yeah got the lovely little case with the two brushes in the original book and all that you know, ain't it cute it's totally cute uh, type test here. 1963 Hermes 3000 in script. Uh, serial number 3213241. Kind of a fun little serial number, too. Technically, this thing is elite. But it's script. They pack them in there pretty tight. I have a blue over green ribbon in here. Because I figure, why not? Why not? The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Ridiculously good print. 
love the way that blue ink stands out. So we got a three position ribbon selector on these and this is gonna be the middle setting. The quick fox, whoop, fox jumps over the lazy dog. See that middle setting gives you a little bit of blue, a little bit of green. Now, all green. A quick brown box jumps over the lazy dog. Yeah. It's so cool, the way the cursive all blends together, the way the letters connect, the way they don't. Because in some places, they don't. Like the B and the R there, they don't connect. But it doesn't matter, it still works. It's ridiculously slick stuff. Um, type alignment's really nice. Tuned that up just a hair. Oh yeah, hey. That space bar. Oh. Just as quiet as it could be, man. So there you go. 1963 Hermes 3000 in uh in script. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Later.